As we get back to weather here, we are talking about some storm chances later this week and last week, as we know, we did have some welcomed rain and those cooler temperatures around. But did the rain help out as far as the uh, drought conditions are concerned? Let's uh, bring in meteorologist Maria Ruiz to talk about uh, more about that. You know, over the summer, we did have the drought that just kind of worsened. We saw exceptional drought, especially in central Texas, but the latest drought monitor unfortunately doesn't show any improvement. It shows actually some in the opposite direction with extreme drought out now extended into the Red River and taking over all of Tarrant, Denton, Dallas, Rockwall, Kaufman, Ellis and Johnson counties. Now this happened because every week this is updated, but data is only taken into consideration up until Tuesday. So the biggest rain days for us last week Thursday was not taken into consideration with this latest update. We will see that number reflected with this week's drought monitor update that does get released on Thursday morning. So don't be deceived by that. So far at DFW, we've picked up 0.31 inches of rain. This is still, still technically a rain deficit by about an inch and 3.35. But over the summer, we only picked up an inch and a quarter. That put us in quite a deficit, not just for the summer, but for the year as well. For the year, we've only picked up over 15 inches of rain, which is still considered an 11 inch rain deficit. So it's going to take a few of these events for this to happen. Some of the big winners, by the way, from last week was just south of Interstate 20 and west of I-35. The good news is that it does look like it will improve here towards the end of September. Tashara.